everybody. Hello. Today we're doing science. Science. <laughs> Started, you'll need your protective eyewear. I've got mine on, and Matt doesn't have any, so he's just wearing his sunglasses. Well, actually, those are mine, but <laughs> I get and the who's dunt those? glasses. Whose are these? Yeah. They're not mine. <laughs> They're not his. Um, so, the first experiment we'll be doing is how to make a foamy mountain, and for this, you will need. Foamy fountain. It's a, fo it's a mountain. How do you make a mountain out of foam? It, it's the experiment's called Foamy Mountain. <laughs> foamy fountain. Misleading. It's a foamy fountain. Okay, so. It's also called the elephant's toothpaste <laughs> experiment. And later you'll see why. I don't want to handle that because I'm scared of it. Okay, what you'll need first is some um, hydrogen peroxide. Oh, I can't see anything in these glasses. <laughs> <laughs> this is probably not safe. Um, and then you pour this into your bottle. How much are we going to pour into it? Right, all of it. I you say. sure? Yeah. But what if. It, you sure you don't. It says it's meant to be half a cup. I know, but that's what half a cup anyway. Mm. <laughs> oh, that looks appetising. Really, it does not look PC. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then we've got some food colouring. We got blue. Yep. It said eight drops. So shall I just fill up these little caps? Oh idea? crap! Okay. <laughs> That is more than eight drops. <laughs> I got Science. fingers. Okay. Um, and then half. Should I want some gloves? I said, should we put on some gloves? Oh, okay. Half a table, half a tablespoon of um, dishwasher liquid. Dishwasher liquid. Is that about half? The great thing about yeah? this is these are all things you could. Why are you looking about? You're going to feed it to me. These are things you can find around the house. Or not, because we had to go shopping for them. Yeah, we are. Uh, Try some? No, we don't. All right, and then you have to shake this up, don't you? Uh, swish the bottle around to give it a mix. Ooh, look, it's blue. We should let you know that we found these experiments on the internet. These are not our own experiments, <laughs> no. clearly, as we have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> this could potentially <laughs> be very really dangerous. Not my bedroom. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> not those glasses, not his bedroom. Um, now we have to mix. You've got your um, packet yeast. I'm just getting blue everywhere. And you mix this with, in here, we've got three tablespoons of warm water. Oh, it smells. <laughs> <laughs> Smell that. Oh, it's vibrant. Oh, it looks like poo. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, it's gone all hard. We didn't think how we were going to get this into the bottle. Oh, we don't have a funnel. <laughs> <laughs> you meant to have a funnel. I think we need to pour this in while it's like activated pretty quickly. Yeah. Right, you ready? Should we put it at the edge of the table? Yeah. No, because that's just... Okay. Put ready? it in the middle of the table. No, I don't want it to like go all over me. It'll go on the floor. It won't. It absolutely will. Okay, you pour it in. What bit does it happen? And mix for about 30 seconds. Mix it. Oh. Mix it up real nice. Oh. Right, now wait for about 30. Oh. Hey! It's working! <laughs> Woo! Science, rise! Science. Rise! <laughs> rise! Yeah! Oh god. Did we think about what oh would happen god. after this? <laughs> Let go. Let go touch your hands. It's smoking. It's warm. Yeah, it's because, because, kids, this is an exothermic reaction. We'll need to double check that, but I no, think no, that's No, no, it is. Right. It's an exothermic reaction. It's it's heated everything up and this has happened because of the heat. That's why you see the smoke. Mmm. The fumes can be toxic. <laughs> You're just staring at it. It's pretty cool, isn't it? It's entrancing. It's not really blue. Well, you said I didn't put... It is kind of blue. It's like a light powder blue. It smells. What does it smell like? 
Is the bottle warm? Oh, it's really warm. Is it? Careful, don't get your finger in the peroxide. Oh, it is. Oh, oh my gosh, it's so hot. So let's have a look at how that worked. You're right, it's an exothermic reaction. I told you. Yeah, I'm right. Yeah, I'm right. Exothermic science. Mm. See, the foam you made is special because each tiny foam bubble is filled with oxygen. Like you're making it boring. The yeast acted as a catalyst. Look to at the camera. The you can see he's just reading it off another screen. <laughs> if, if you think he's clever, he's not because he's just reading this off a laptop. From the hydrogen peroxide. Okay. Wow. Oh my gosh, it's so hot. We've learned a lot today. That was quite fun, wasn't it? That was good. That was good. Okay. Oh, and there's more. Science experiment number two. Number two. Our uh, next experiment, we're going to be making a homemade lava lamp. So we've got all of our is it ingredients. S yes, I Seal. suppose if you count uh, glitter, glitter as ingredients. Ingredient. Yeah. Okay. So what you'll need to do first is um, pour out some of your. Uh, vegetable oil because you just need this three quarters full. <laughs> you might need adult supervision. Okay, tell me when it when tell me when you think it's a quarter. Just keep checking. Keep okay. checking. Well, that's a lot of oil. Now you need to pour in a quarter of water. A quarter a quarter of water. Ooh. Fancy. It already looks so weird. So now what we need to do is Oh, don't knock it over. Put in um a couple of droplets of your chosen food colouring. We're gonna use blue again. Right now I promise I need to do like drops instead of what I did last time, just chuck it in. Oh god. Oh no. Oh that was a good drop. Oh look at it. Woo! Oh, it looks cool. Look at it keep its shape on the way down. Because it's like through the oil. Fancy. How many more? Two, a couple more. Like that? Yeah. Do you think that's enough? One more. Oh, I know, measure. I've got it on the outside. Clean up on aisle four. Is that enough? Yep. Stop. Okay. Oh, probably too much. Shut up. Okay. And we've also got some glitter. Um, so, yeah, I just found this is just old in my makeup box. I've got some pink glitter. So, should I just put that in as well? Yeah, just a dibble dabble, do you? Just really? a little bit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my measurements. Oh my god, I've got blue food colouring and everything. Right. It's so precise. Wait. We have to put the tablet in now. No. What do we do now? Give it a shake. Yeah. Really? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What, turn it upside down. Yeah. Swoosh it. Oh. Oh, that 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 glitter is just staying. And it's in just it clumpy. In a big lab. That's definitely like separated now. Yeah. Okay, so, so now you've got to break up. Um. An effervescent tablet. We're using Brocca, but you can use Alka Seltzer. If you don't have this, you can just use table salt. Yeah. Ooh. That's so satisfying to break up. Okay, now look at this big just glob of glitter. Well, I've got a spoon somewhere. Where did my spoon go? Oh, there it is. My yeast spoon. That's not going to fit. Use the other end. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Just trying to break it up a little bit. Okay, it's in a while, isn't it? Ooh. Fancy. It's so shimmy. Okay, if you're using Dazzle Dust, don't. I'd recommend just going and buying some glitter from like a craft store or something. Although it is it is looking a bit shinier now. I just, <laughs> oh my god, just break up. Oh, it's so satisfying. This is like <laughs> the weirdest <laughs> lava lamp. If time. somebody bought you this for Christmas, you'd be like, uh... There we go. This is not like a DIY present. Perfect. Don't give this to your friends. Perfect. They won't be friends with you anymore. Okay, so let's put the first... Can I put the first bit in? Go on. 
can't really see it. No, wait, it said... Once it hits the bottom, that's when it will start fizzing, because in the oil it won't react. Oh, yeah! So once it hits the bottom, it'll... Matt brings the science. Bringing the science. Science a Matt. in GCSE. All right. I got a C in GCSE. <laughs> Although I was in the top class. I don't think that's much of a like. <laughs> what? I boast to say that I got an A in GCSE. It's not like... It's quite hard. It's not like a master's. <laughs> <laughs> I got an A. I wish I got an A. Why is that turning black? I don't know. We're not very good at the science lot, is it? We're learning, as are you. Yeah, it's gone black. Wait, no, let me put in one more. Well, let's get some more. No, it said only one on the instructions. Oh, who's ever played by the rules before? Scientists played yeah, by the rules. To... That does look kind of Whoa, fancy. Whoa, it's cool. Yeah. I'm going to turn it round because I think that's where it's all sort of happening. Oh, Maybe you can see all the... Put the cap back on. Yeah, put on. the cap on. Should we take this bit off? There we go. Yeah. Wow! It's looking pretty fancy! Science. Science. You're welcome. <laughs> This isn't really an experiment. We found this Wait, on the internet. Is. We're unsure if it's going to work. Basically, <laughs> you make s water vapour inside of a small water bottle by leaving a tiniest bit of water inside of it at the bottom and twisting it to a point where the pressure builds up inside. You take the cap off and water vapour is inside. To me, that sounds like it's not going to work at all, but in the video it did. So. Go on then. It's worth a try. I'm a bit scared. Plus, this isn't as flimsy a bottle oh, as it should be. Oh, stop making excuses. Right. I'm scared. How much do you have to twist it? Until it won't twist no more. Oh. Gosh. It's so squeaky. All right, go. I'm scared. What, do I just, do just, I just open it? it? I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. Well, that did not work at all. <laughs> it made a, did I take it off too slow? It made a little, yeah, I think. It did I take it off to too like, slow? Yeah. Can we try it again? No. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> well, we can try it again. Take two. Ah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> no, that's you not sure? gonna work, Chicken's not gonna work. Oh, we'll try it. Does it do good? Oh. Yeah, ready? That's poo! <laughs> I can feel the pressure in there, obviously, but... Is it meant to have rubbing alcohol in it? In one of the videos it was, but <laughs> in another one it said just use water. Okay, well, experiment number three has failed. There's a chance for me to prove my but, masculinity. as new scientists, failure is a part of experiments. It's, uh, yeah. And two of ours were successful. The first one was really good. Learning. Yes. Educational. This is educational. It didn't work. We're sorry. The others were good. It makes me rubbish. But, um, thanks. <laughs> like a little sad snowman, like, why? Um, thanks for tuning in and watching this video. Uh, like and subscribe, and put in the comments what you'd like to see us do next. Probably not that. Probably that not that. Bye. Bye.